welcome to the recruiting corner, Big County Preps, Preston Jackson, former Notre Dame defensive back. We are talking about running backs, and specifically, we're going down south to Miami. Triple C's, Carroll City High School, we're going to go Naquan Wright. When evaluating running backs, you're always thinking, okay, well, what kind of running back is he? Is he a bruiser, slasher? Is he one of those guys, a one-cut home run hitter? So, when I was watching Naquan Wright, it struck me that he was very similar to a guy we had seen in the state championship, also from the South Florida area. And I'll tell you who that is shortly. But let's talk about Mr. Wright specifically before we go into his film. Right now, according to 247, he's the 10th running back ranked in the nation. 30th best prospect in Florida. 4th best running back prospect in Florida. Two of those top running backs are at IMG Academy. Another one is at University School in Fort Lauderdale. And then Naquan Wright comes in at a close fourth place if you're one of those ranking type people who follows it very closely. Very similar to one running back who played at the University of Miami, who left the University of Miami, setting all type of rushing records and currently holds the rushing record for yardage gained from scrimmage, Duke Johnson. And if he ends up anything like Duke, he can have a really good career. Let's jump into the film. We're going to take it back not just a few months ago in his junior year campaign. We're going to actually go to his sophomore year. I thought his sophomore film was better than his junior film. So let's jump into it. Tell you what I see. You know how this goes. React on site. And then we'll bring in Duke Johnson. Again, right here, number five. Get off me. Uh. Unfortunately, this is one of our local schools, Lake Gibson. He's playing against the championship game. But now he's playing against Lakeland, another Polk County team. And if you know anything about Central to South Florida, there's a lot of speed there. But when he's out running guys, he's out running guys. One cut. Strength. Gets to the second level, strong and strength. Now he shows the speed to score. You see how he can avoid tackles. He's not elusive, but he avoids tackles. That is the difference. He's not absorbing straight up blows. He's not a herky-jerky running back. He finds his lane, and he gets to the spot. And there's nothing fancy about it. There's nothing like, say, oh, wow, he's just a... No. He sees the lane and goes with what he sees. Even though this is a highlight film... We've seen guys get hands on him, but we have not seen him getting taken down yet. He finds the end zone, finds the crease, has enough speed to beat the competition to get to where he needs to get to. You see his frame, he's got a great looking frame on him. Look at his running style, remember what I'm telling you, one cut, hit, fine lane, hit, not herky jerky, because when I turn on Duke's highlight, compared to what you see here, Versus Duke Johnson's high school highlight film. Look at the strength. Look how strong he runs. Runs behind his pads. I ran it back a little bit too far. But let it run right here. One, two, three guys. It's still an 11-yard game. Once he gets ahead of steam, he's a hard pill to swallow. You're going to have trouble bringing this guy down. Hits the, look at the balance right there. Stay on feet after contact. Stay on his feet after contact. There he is. Avoiding tackles. Exploding in to tacklers. Oh. Mmm. Mm. Stiffy at the end. Mm. Mm. 
one cut. Finds the crease, finds the hole. Not much dancing. Same thing with Mr. Right. Find the crease, find the hole, hit it. Avoid tacklers. Not crazy elusiveness, but avoid tacklers. Similar run right there. Duke Johnson, University of Miami, all-time career leader in rushing. That's a tough run. A little counter play. Find the crease. Find the crease, Duke. Find the crease, Duke. That's it. That's it. Not going to do too much. Just going to do enough to make sure we get to where we need to get to. Duke Johnson. Nyquan Wright, very similar running styles. Duke Johnson ends his career as University of Miami's all-time leading rusher from scrimmage. Cleveland Browns. And we're going to end it right there. Dude, we got to end it right there. All right, let's tie everything in here. Nyquan Wright from Carroll City, 5'8", 185 pounds. I think he's a good one. I think he is the next coming of Duke Johnson. And we know how good Duke Johnson was. For the Canes. He can be that type of back. He can carry the ball 20 times a game. He can play from the eye or he can play in the zone scheme. It does not matter. He's a downhill runner. He's got great footwork, outstanding balance. He's got a really strong lower frame. He can take the punishment and he can avoid it all at the same time. I think that this kid is the next coming of a legend. Duke Johnson mirrors his running style and you know what Duke Johnson ended up like now with the Cleveland Browns NFL style runner Naquan Wright can be the next one out of Carroll City and if you like this channel subscribe if you like this post please comment double back so we can have that conversation we'll have a bunch of dialogue going back and forth and we'll break down more prospects not just in Florida but across the nation till next time recruiting quarter out